Hey, hey everyone, Samantha Pointer here with Samantha Pointer Enterprises. Thanks for joining me today as I start a new little series this week uh, talking all about why you may be disorganized in your business. <clears throat> so, um, as you may or may not know, when I started my business uh, over 20 years ago, I was a professional organizer. And during the years, you know, I helped people clean clutter, clean clutter out of their business, clean clutter out of their lives. Like, organization is in ground in me. So, that is why <clears throat> when I transition more to the tech side and automation side of things, uh, I still bought an element of organization because that is super important to your business. I find way too many businesses struggle because they're missing the organization piece. Uh, organization is really vital for your business to run smoothly. Even before you automate anything, you really need to get organized. You need to get organized in your thoughts and your systems and things of that nature. So today's quick tip is we're going to start with reason number one why you may be disorganized in your business and that is you don't have any systems okay um <clears throat> what i mean by systems so when i used to work a full-time job that job had systems in place i knew what i was supposed to do i knew when i was supposed to do it and in what order i was supposed to do it so there was no way for me to mess things up because everything was outlined in my employee handbook, right? So I knew what I was supposed to be doing. And I think what happens is when we transition from working, hey, Valerie, when we transition from uh, working for somebody to working for ourselves, disorganization systems, all that goes out the window, right? <laughs> so, um, so, you have to learn how to set up those same systems that you need for your business tailored toward your business. So if you don't have a place for everything, if you don't know what you're doing every day in your business, if you don't know what processes you have in your business, how it's supposed to look, who who is supposed to do them, whether that's you or whether you have help like with a VA or an assistant or something, uh, you're going to be disorganized. You, your, your business is going to be like flapping in the wind. So having no system is reason number one why you may be, be disorganized in your business. So you may be saying, well, how do I rectify that? Well, first place you need to start is really listing everything that you do in your business right now. What do I need? What tasks do I need? Uh, when I'm onboarding a client, what does that look like? When I'm, um, <clears throat> When I take a discovery call for my coaches, uh, what does that look like? Do I need to send out something afterwards? Uh, where? What's the next step? All that needs to be documented. All that needs to be documented. And then from there, you figure out, okay, which system, which tools can I use to automate this process? What can be automated in this process? Uh, what software? It, it, it goes from there. But the first step is actually documenting what you do on the day-to-day -day business. And then from there, you can figure out what system you need to put in place in order for it to run smoothly. Now, that is something that I help my clients do all the time. I help them analyze their business to see what's going on, what do they need, what steps are going on in their business, where are the gaps, uh, what, what systems am I missing, if I, or what systems, if I have a system in place, is it even actually working? Because a lot of people, a lot of business owners don't really monitor their systems to see if it's working or not, or if it's been going on so long that it's time for a change so that is what I help my clients to do I help you uh, look at what systems you have in place where you need systems I come up with a system for your business and then I help you implement that I help you figure out what automation what can be automated of those systems uh, what needs to be delegated of those systems that is what I do I do system setup that is what I help my clients do 
So I have a quick start tech session if you're seeing that, hey, you know, I, I really find that I've been really disorganized in my business and I need to get some something in place. I need to get something started because even just having one system in place will do wonders for your business. Um, I want you to reach out to me. You can go to bit.ly forward slash quick start tech. And I will put that into the comment section, but it's bit.ly forward slash quick start tech and go ahead and get started with my four hour quick start tech session where I set up one automation system for you, where I help you get organized in your business, get those files organized, get those processes down. Uh, my, um, <clears throat> Quick Start Tech Evaluation, thanks, uh, thanks. Uh, my Quick Start Tech Evaluation is included in this, and what that is is a workbook that helps you get down everything going on in your business and start putting the things into place. And then you get my help to, <laughs> then you get my help to actually uh, implement it. So again, that's bit.ly forward slash quick start tech. Uh, I'm going to be coming on every day, giving you a new reason why you may be disorganized in your business. But today, like I said, the number one reason is because you don't have a system. So if you find that you don't have a system, you're needing a system, you're needing help getting a system, you're needing help figuring out what systems your business needs, then I, I, uh, invite you to reach out to me uh, at bit.ly forward slash quick start tech session and join me tomorrow for reason number two, why you might be disorganized in your business. Thanks again for joining me. If you're a replay viewer, just hashtag replay. Uh, if you have any quick, uh, any questions about what I've talked about today, be sure to drop them in the comments and I'll be happy to answer them. Bye for now.